Oh, hi. Hello. Um, hey, it's Heidi. Hump days with Heidi. This week, week number two, um, is about coming out and good things like that. What? Okay. Uh, basically I was in denial for like, ever. I was like, I think I like boys. But I always was really fascinated with, with girls. I was dating this girl and we were like best friends or whatever, which we were, but um, yeah, I don't know, my parents kind of, like, it's weird that we always, like, hang out alone, we'd be, like, in my room, like, alone, we'd always just, we'd always be together. Okay, like, I used to be, like, huge into Post Secret. Post Secret. For those of you who don't know what it is, which you probably all do, um, it's this guy, Frank Warren, he started this thing where he would, uh, mail out a postcard to him and just tell him, like, it would be anonymous and you just tell him a secret about yourself. So I wanted to make one about like possibly being gay and about dating one of my best friends. So I made one, right? And um, obviously not very good at hiding things. So I made one and my mom came in my room. She's like, oh, what's this? And it's like a little postcard. And I was like, oh, nothing. I'm a terrible, just terrible liar. She just like kind of just cried on the bed. And she's like, I don't understand. I don't understand. And I was just like, ah, this is really weird. Like, I don't know. Then they decided to have a family meeting but what the family meeting that didn't include my two sisters just included me and my parents. And they're like, okay, yeah, so you know how you can't have boys sleep over? Well, you can't have girls sleep over now either. So I moved out. I was like, fuck this, like, I'm gonna live my life. And I wanted kind of um, a safe area for, like, me to be me. And I've actually totally accepted it now. And, like, both my sisters, super cool with it. They're amazing. Who I came out to first was probably the first girl that I dated, actually. I, she was dating one of my friends, one of my guy friends, and I was like, mm, like, damn, damn. She was cute. Just, like, felt the vibes going, and, um, she was actually the first one to kiss me. And so after that, I was just like, yep, I am for sure a gay. We actually dated for a year, but we dated pretty much in like secrecy so I didn't really tell anyone about it but like people kind of knew yeah so I'm pretty much out to like everyone now so that's great um who I haven't come out to I haven't come out to my extended family either they are very religious they're all super Christian and I feel like if I have like a serious girlfriend or something that I would bring them to the family gatherings just like my sister brings her boyfriend and that would be the time to be like, hey, this is my girlfriend. Yeah. Um, New Year's resolutions? I want to lose weight. Everyone wants to lose weight, but I would like to lose weight. Master the harmonica. I don't really know anything about it. There's like this whole thing about like the different notes and like the different placements. And if you like, you have to like put your tongue over some notes in order to like get different. I don't know. It's weird. I don't get it. I don't really like making out with harmonica uncomfortable I should probably drink less beer let's see okay celebrity crushes I have a lot of celebrity crushes for example Natalie Portman Scarlett Johansson I have so many I can't even think of them all um this is really creepy actually, but I have a um, baby crush on Taylor Momsen. Kinda weird, cause she's like, I think she's like legitimately like 16. Maybe I shouldn't post that. Zoe Deschanel. Mm. Yep. I like femme girls. <sighs> femme girls on my faves. I don't know. I think that's all I got. Yeah. Peace out.